in my view, uh, India is uh, uh, is, the, is a place to do business with. Uh, it is uh, a, a robust economy uh, where the rule of law is uh, prevailing, uh, and that's a, a pivotal, it's a fundamental issue for companies and uh, economic operators doing business to have. Uh, uh, yeah, to have a healthy uh, economy, healthy level playing field where you can uh, go to courts if you have problems and where you have the free choice of uh, consumers. Actually, it goes hand in hand with democracy. The free market goes hand in hand with democracy. democracy. And uh, when it comes to uh, uh, our relations, uh, India and Iceland relations, uh, we can. Uh, there are a lot of complementarities. We we can. We have been working together in fisheries uh, and in preservation uh, of of the seas, uh, of the stocks uh, under the UN, uh, uh, under the FAO. Uh, also combating pollute, pollution in the seas, uh, plastic pollution, etc. So we are partners there. We can. Iceland can contribute when it comes to sustainable fisheries. Uh, and we, we can work together there on, on the utilization of the stock. Also when it comes to ge geothermal energy, India has uh, uh, uncharted territory in, in uh, geothermal energy and I say uh, it is of course not the, uh, the solution to, to the climate uh, crisis or, or to the climate challenge we are facing now, but it's one of the solutions. It's one of the solutions, and there Iceland and India cannot only work, they are working together. We have beautiful projects uh, going on uh, between uh, our countries in, in India, uh, from cooling down uh, apples uh, from, from geothermal energy to, to heating houses and, and uh, uh, schools uh, with geothermal energy, so this is this is uh, absolutely a win-win situation. There, uh, we also need highly skilled workforce in Iceland. We need educated uh, experts in the field of IT, IT engineers. Uh, uh, we have a flourishing gaming industry uh, in Iceland that is a, a, a need for for world. Uh, uh, a top top notch experts uh, that you have in abundance so we have many many synergies and i'm really looking forward to concluding our fta negotiations i think uh, the g20 the how india uh, managed and and uh, hosted the g20 meeting it's a it's a success story uh, and uh, many important decisions were taken uh, and uh, I think uh, just that India, uh, India showed its uh, leadership uh, and resilience in, in, hosting, in hosting the meeting and, and conducting the whole meeting and uh, I think the, I think the world uh, saw India before the meeting and still sees just got, got a confirmation that uh, it's, a, it's a reliable partner and uh, it's, uh, it's a go-to place to do business with.